Hey, welcome back. Um, this is going to be my little cookie experiment. Uh, I've cut many in the past, and uh, they tend to split. It's it's known they do. So these are all fresh pine logs, um, white pine, somewhere in the 10, 12 inch diameter range. Uh, they were actually cut yesterday. So we've, Scott's got that many cut at the moment. Um, we cut them in three foot lengths and then just stand them in here in the wood miser. And thank goodness the, for the hydraulics. It, it clamps right in really nice. So that's really easy. We cut them, like I said, in three foot lengths. So we cut the logs at nine feet to start with. So we can get 22 inch and a quarter pieces out of each one. So check out the saw one. This is the orientation I do when they're cutting the, the big ovals. Um, that's a pretty extreme angle. Uh, somewhere around 25 degrees, 30. Uh, really makes some neat ovals. Here's the ones here. We done those on about a 45 degree angle. And uh, they're close to double length as they are in width. They tend to stay together a lot better that way too, as far as cracking. So these right here is going to be really neat. They're, I'm hoping they're close to two feet long. So, check it out. Thirty feet of uh, white pine logs made that many cookies these are all ovals some longer some shorter and all these are just slanted rounds there's 196 here and then there's 116 of these so that is a pretty good yield from 130 feet it was actually just one tree one whole entire tree um, so really got no waste out of it anyways uh going to i got them all strapped up as you can see and we're going to put them in the kiln probably um in three or four days um, i'll i'll document that for you guys and we'll see how the process goes uh, i'm gonna do them at a lower temperature for probably four or five days um, and see where they're at. I'd like to get them to around 15% and hopefully with a 50% yield of good ones. But these actually will probably do a lot better than those. 
so just because the grain is perpendicular to the face of the cut with those and it's more slanted with these so the, the grain is actually longer in each individual one so hopefully they stay together anyways thanks for watching you guys like and subscribe